All right, troopers, welcome to our course on building an integrated three statement model in Excel. Let's discuss uh, for a moment what you'll be able to actually do, practically speaking, after the section. Obviously, we want you to be able to build an integrated financial model in Excel that incorporates the income statement, balance sheet, and cash flow statement. But in our lesson to build an integrated financial model, we're also going to be learning a few key things along the way, and these are the real takeaway learning points. First, uh, we want to show you exactly how the three statements link together conceptually in detail. Uh, with that knowledge and understanding, we want you to be able to develop really transferable corporate finance theory and, theory and skills that are applicable to many different types of businesses and industries. We're going to model one particular example of a public company, but the concepts that we're going to be talking about related to financial statement analysis and theory are transferable to many, many different types of, types of companies that you might uh, model. Next, we want to help you develop a sense of judgment and instinct for how to actually put together and structure a financial model. And related to that, how to read and interpret financial statements to get at the information you need, whether it's you know, in the direct uh, three statements themselves, uh, in, for example, public company filings like the 10Ks, uh, or in the management discussion and analysis portion uh, where, uh, you know, there are relevant footnotes that can help you interpret the financial statements, such as the debt footnote or the depreciation and amortization footnote, etc. And lastly, we want to, you know, help you put into practice some uh, really practical Excel tips and shortcuts that will be useful in real-world modeling situations to help you become really efficient and effective uh, at modeling in Excel. Cool. So this is going to be our curriculum for building out an integrated three-statement financial model. Don't panic. It may look like a lot. It may look overwhelming. But when you break things down into chunks, as we're going to do, fundamentally, financial modeling and valuation isn't hard. It just involves knowing some basic accounting rules, applying some basic corporate finance principles, and communicating this using historical and projection data in Excel. Now, before we jump right in, let's do a very quick refresher on how the three statements are actually going to link together in our model. And we're going to pick up with that lesson uh, momentarily in our next video. So stick around.